Mata. This is late night news. You are you and I'm Barak Datta. Tonight's biggest mind boggliest and flatline causing headline is finding no other nation left to attack. The United States of America has launched a massive assault on its own homeland. Yes, that's the shock of this art. After having invaded every nation on earth, left with no other alternatives, American troops have invaded their own country. to talk about this paradigm changing event we have with us, Timothy J. Romer, American ambassador to India. <laughs> Welcome, Mr. Timothy. Um, so is this Fox News? <laughs> no, this is LNN, late night news. Look, I was supposed to talk to Fox News and they killed Osama instead of Obama. <laughs> no, I think you mean they killed Obama instead of Osama. Yeah, I mean, that's what I said, no? Not really, not really. Anyway, why did America invade itself? Look, we are not answerable to anybody. It's like everybody has a right to touch himself or herself, <laughs> you know? But still, why would a country invade itself? Look, what do you want us to do? I mean, keep invading the same damn places again and again? There's nothing left there. Plus, I mean, invading at home has lots of perks, you know? Soldiers feel at home, no homesickness, and... They can always blow up a McDonald's after having a good meal there. And one strange thing is, we are hearing that you are taking Pakistan's help in this war. Well, see, Pakistan is our ally in the war on terror, and we are paying them to fight this war. They better do a good job, I and mean, we've been paying them for, what, 10 years? And they didn't do anything. Finally, we had to go there and kill Osama all by ourselves. <laughs> Did I say Osama or um, Obama? Osama, Osama, yeah. Good, good. See, I am learning. So, yes, I was saying Pakistan has taken so much money and did nothing. So now, they can compensate us by helping us in this war. But don't you feel guilty destroying your own country? Yes, I mean, we do. Look, this is the first time we are going to a war with a country having no real oil resources. It's a tough call, but hey, you gotta do what you gotta do. And hopefully Osama will be re-elected. You said Osama this time, Osama. Oh, fuck it, man. Look, who cares? Yeah? <laughs> Bye. <laughs> so this was US ambassador to India, Timothy Ross, something, something. And for the fools in the American Midwest, let me explain. If you don't know where India is and also fail to understand any words outside the Bible, Fear not your God-fearing American soldiers are about to put you out of your misery. Coming up, Justin Bieber feels Rebecca Black has a better range than Barbara Streisand and Tiger Woods claims his aim is a lot better than the Navy SEALs who shot Osama. There's a lot happening tonight, but I'm not just in the mood for news. Good luck, stay alive, and I'll see you better late than never.